Hey, hey, good morning. It's the end of November and uh, you join me on the hills of home for me. So this is the Northern Carnethai. Um, I've got uh, Voile Brass up that way and then Drim up that way. Uh, I've cycled from home and I'm cycling up onto Drim um, with a view to, well, aim number one is to walk up Voile Brass and fly off it. It's one of the Welsh 3000s that I haven't flown off yet, despite it being the one that's uh, closest to home. Um, and uh, if that doesn't work, because the, the, the two forecasts, or two forecasts differ really as to whether it's going to be flyable or not. If that doesn't work, then I will uh, use it as an excuse to see if there's enough snow for skiing, which uh, this is one of my favourite ski hills, this slope coming down from Voile Vras towards Drim. So I brought the dog with me, we're out for a bit of a run, and uh, either it works or it doesn't, but either way, we'll, uh, we'll have a nice time. It's a stunning morning as you can see, a bit of a inversion over the Conwy Valley. I've got a full moon up that way behind you. And then just looking now to Voile Vras, it doesn't look like either plan's gonna work. It doesn't look like there's enough snow for skiing. And it doesn't look like it's gonna be flyable because it's, it's quite breezy here. But I'm gonna go for a walk up there anyway, see what it's like on the top. Because it's just beautiful being out, it's stunning. So I'll drop down a little bit further on the bike, leave the bike and then head on up on the ridge. Right, so I've transitioned to walking, which is a nice opportunity to uh, warm the feet up a bit. And get cold feet on a bike. summit just got some uh, some squalls of snow coming in from the north so it's just clouded over a little bit so it was a good time on the way up that was super super pretty beautiful and I've got a heck of a view I can see pretty much the whole of Anglesey Bumaris is in the sunshine down there and then the whole of the Carnedi so Ur Ellen which we flew off uh, on Saturday it's Wednesday today uh, kind of um, one of my lockdown videos was skiing across here up onto Thruellen and then back home again um, and then in the background we can see Carnith David and then over this way I can see Shabod and then uh, the Conway Valley lit up the cloud inversion lit up so it's a beautiful beautiful vantage point I can see the Isle of Man a moment ago as well but that's now hidden behind her bank of cloud which is coming my way. Right, time for an extra layer and then we'll get the oh, throw that away. Get the anemometer out, measure the wind speed. So my plan was just to do a really short hop really from here back to Drim. I don't want it to be too windy. If it's, uh, I don't really want lift. I don't want to go up. I just want to just gently float back down because it's only a short flight back to my bike. So there's no point to it. It's literally just for fun. So I don't want it to be stressful. So if it's uh, too windy and it's going to be stressful, I'll just leave it for another day. So the wind has actually dropped a bit and it is sort of averaging six miles an hour. So we'll have a go. Turn your short hop, down, cross, back to the bike. And we're off. Yeah. Oh, 
Fantastic! Move right. One from home. Gentle glide to the bike. Good job. Yeah. Good job. Good job. Good job. Good job. Mega. It's actually some quite nice soaring. It's a nice steady wind. We'll stay up a bit. Fantastic. That's the nice weather behind it. Just coming into a little bit of a squall, so we won't stay up for too long. to the bike. Mm. <laughs> Fantastic. And here comes the dog. Good boy, Rumi. Good boy, good lad. Hey, good boy. Good lad, good boy. There we are, Mega, mind the, mind the lines. We get tangled up. Good boy, good lad. Wow, you've got some snow on you now, haven't you? Hey? Good lad, nice. There we are, Void for us, the closest of the Welsh 3000s to home for me. And it's, uh, yeah, it's only about 10 o'clock in the morning, so go home, do some editing, and of course, have a big breakfast, or maybe a bowl of soup, warm the cockles. Thanks for watching, see you next time.